right turn, hurt, hugger, hold, present, card. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Order, colors, left turn, perch, forward, perch. Good evening and welcome to Cherokee High School's 24th Annual Academic Night. Tonight, we celebrate the outstanding academic performance of our students who, despite the trials and challenges of the last eight months, have pressed onward and accomplished so many things in so many ways. These students have found strength and resilience to advance to their levels of achievement though these unprecedented circumstances have tried to limit them. These students have been determined to find answers to problems never before posed. These students have shown true warrior spirit and kept excelling no matter what their classroom looked like. We certainly wish we could all be gathered together as we have been in the past but as we have all seen and experienced, this year is different. Yet, in the face of all of these, we honor those who have succeeded through struggle and redefine academic excellence. Congratulations, warrior students and families. We are so proud of you all. Welcome to the 2020 to 2021 National Honor Society induction ceremony. I'm Ms. Matthews, I'm Cherokee High School's advisor for National Honor Society. Today I represent our student officers, President Abby Taylor, Vice President Ashlyn Carroll, Historian Harrison Russ, Treasurer Cassidy Knowles, and Secretary Sidney Tang. I would like to thank you for attending this ceremony where we will honor our new members. The membership of the Cherokee chapter of National Honor Society has been earned by the effective demonstration of four qualities held in high esteem by the society. Scholarship, service, leadership, and character. Scholarship denotes a commitment to learning. A student is willing to spend hours in reading and study, knowing that the lasting benefits are a cultivated mind. We should continue to learn even when formal education is ended, for human education ends only when life ends. Knowledge is one great element in life. It leads to the highest success. It can be acquired in only one way, through diligence and effort. Learning furnishes the lamp by which we read the past, the torch guiding us to understand the present, and the light that illuminates the future. Candidates have the responsibility to continually expand their world through opportunities inherent in scholarship. Service can be described in various ways. Service can be established in the routine of the day's work, where opportunities arise to help others, both at school, work, at home and through the community. A willingness to work for the benefit of those in need without monetary compensation or recognition is the quality we seek in our membership and promote for the entire student body. We are committed to volunteering our time, our talents, all in order for the creation of a better tomorrow. Leadership should exert a wholesome influence on the school in taking initiative in the classroom and in school activities a real leader strives to train and aid others to reach their common goals of success. The price of leadership is sacrifice, the willingness to yield one's personal interests for the interests of others. A leader has self-confidence and will go forward when others hesitate. No matter what power and resources may exist in a school, community, or nation, they are ineffectual without the guidance of a wise leader. Leadership is always needed. Thus, to lead is a meaningful and essential charge to each of our members. Finally, character. Character is the force within the individual that distinguishes each person from others. It creates for each of us our individuality, our goodness. It is without which no one can find oneself, respect oneself, nor hope to obtain the respect of others. 
It is a force of character that guides one through life and, once developed, grows steadily within. Character is achieved and not received. It is the product of constant thought and action, the daily striving to make the right choice. The problem of character is the problem of self-control. We must, in reality, be what we wish to appear to others, to be rather than to seem. By demonstrating such qualities as respect, responsibility, trustworthiness, bearing, affair, careness, and citizenship, we may hope to prove, by example, that we value character. All of our new members have successfully demonstrated scholarship, service, leadership, and character. Congratulations to our new members of Cherokee High School's National Honor Society. Good evening. My name is Charlie Ingham, and I'm the Assistant Principal for Curriculum here at Cherokee High School. It's important that our audience understand what a significant achievement the accomplishment of an academic letter or academic lamp is. Students who receive an academic letter have a 90 or higher numerical grade point average over two consecutive years. Recipients of an academic lamp have a 90 or higher grade point average over three consecutive years. Such consistent academic achievement is staggering, especially considering the circumstances we face today. Congratulations, students.
Thank you for attending tonight's 24th annual Academic Night. Tonight, more than 500 students were recognized, nearly a fifth of the CHS student population. Tonight, more academic letters and lamps have been earned and National Honor Society members inducted than any other time in the history of Cherokee High School. Tonight, we know how strong our students are and how determined they are to reach their full potential. We know they are not doing this amazing alone. Without the support of their outstanding fellow students, their supportive families, their remarkable teachers, these feats could not be achieved. Thank you all for the love and support you provide daily to these students. Together, we are the warrior nation. Stay safe and be well.